All new at 9, a St. Louis family says the cemetery where they buried a dozen family members is now in, quote, horrible condition. Fox 2's Zara Barker is live in South St. Louis County near the new St. Marcus Cemetery. Zara. One family tells me they're raising concerns and complaining because of conditions at this cemetery. My father, my grandfather, great grandfather, great grandmother. Teresa Cooper says she has at least a dozen family members buried at New St. Marcus Cemetery, including her father. We deserve a nice place for our relatives and they deserve a peaceful place and it's not peaceful at all. It's, it's sad. Cooper says her dad passed away 20 years ago, and this is where she spends time with him. But she says the cemetery's conditions are heartbreaking. It was once beautiful, peaceful place. We would come and have picnics here. Now we don't even like to come. These are pictures of the cemetery Cooper shared with us. She says tombstones are knocked over. There's mud and dirt from fresh graves spilled onto her father's grave. She says there's overgrown grass, and she says it's difficult to drive through because of potholes, flooded areas, and low-hanging trees. I would never in a million years bury any of my relatives here today. And if I had the means, I would take Dad out tomorrow and put him someplace else. It's just gotten to the point where it's, it's shameful for us to have to come and pay our respects to our loved ones and, you know, feel like, <laughs> I don't know, we're in ruins here. Cooper says she even brings her own weed eater. I don't think we have to, should have to bring our own equipment to clean off our loved ones' graves, and, and we do every time we come to visit. She also says she hasn't been able to get a hold of anyone at the cemetery. They won't answer the door, they don't answer the phone. I want them to clean it up, and I want it to be a beautiful place like it once was. I mean, our loved ones deserve that. But she believes she's not alone in the frustration. There is plenty of recent Google uh, reviews about how horrible this place is and how it used to be beautiful. So I'm not the only family member who is, you know, upset. I called the cemetery's office today and I also rang the doorbell outside of the office here behind me. No one answered or returned my calls. Live tonight from South St. Louis County, Zara Barker, Fox 2 News.